this is a, a major step uh, towards more transparency uh, in the European Union and globally. So I, I can't overstate how important uh, an achievement this, this would be. Uh, public, country by country, uh, information on profits, paid by multi, uh, booked by multinational companies, taxes paid by multinational companies, etc., et is essential to monitor tax avoidance uh, and, and to think about uh, better tax policies and to simulate things, for instance, like a country-by-country -country minimum tax. So I very much welcome the uh, near conclusion of uh, uh, an agreement uh, in the European Union on, on that uh, question, and this very important question. 80% of the tax shifting, um, of the profit shifting of multinationals in Europe is between the EU 27 member states. So for our purposes, 80% of the tax avoidance activity will become transparent. And of course I would have preferred to have also the data uh, for the remaining countries. But, no, but now we can uh, trigger a positive dynamic. More and more countries can adopt similar laws and then we get the complete picture. It is a big step. And I've seen it also work uh, in the Netherlands, where indeed Shell and Philips have decided to code for country-by-country country reporting, and that immediately changed the public debate in the Netherlands. There was immediately a, 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 an additional law introduced to make sure that indeed Shell paid its taxes also in the Netherlands. So it has an impact. It will set a minimum standard from which we can build onwards. I fully agree on the... On the uh Country-by-country country report, it's a step further. Uh, of course, you, you never uh, achieve uh, all what you, you want. This, I think, is, well, it's m maybe a, a little bit too obvious. Uh, uh, and, of course, ambition should be remain there, and, but please don't underestimate the effort that was made. Uh, by the Parliament and the co-legislators to reach this uh, goal.